hello guys welcome so you guys know that a few months ago um cora obidi and her american husband justin dean called it quits and um you know there was a lot of back and forth following their marriage after they broke up um they went really it was actually a very crazy social media drama following their separation but months later cora obidi has come out to say that justin dean her husband her ex-husband you know is asking for spousal support and also asks um you know the court to grant him full custody of the children that he wants to take the children away from her i think that's very sad um you know she came out and shared a video talking about what she's been going through also said that she didn't want to share it but because um online in-laws have been with her you know in this whole saga she just thought to share this part and also to um let people know what is going on let's listen to her he asked for the children full custody but now he's asking for spousal support i was gonna not talk about this anymore not you know the, but this is not ending it's unending and the more i don't want to grovel i don't want to you guys are going through divorce with me you're going through divorce with me this is what is happening i have been paying 1800 on child's on um, school fees and health insurance for my daughters since february this man has not contributed one dollar just for me to just for me to get something from my attorney today telling me point plain that he is asking for spousal support and he is asking for basically my children to immediately it's called an expert be immediately taken away from me co-parenting peace is a lie this is not what co-parenting in peace looks like and i'm thanks for chukunam i'm thankful that the judge and people are seeing through all of this ruse. I think that if you, I think that it's time for us to just sue for defamation. He wants me to start to pay him now. He wants me to pay him money, spousal support. Okay, Justin, what's up? Because right now, um, with what Coral B D is saying, she's been paying um fees from since February, and Justin hasn't contributed a dime according to what she says and now it's funny because when i think of why does justin want to have full custody is cora a terrible mom is cora a bad mom has cora neglected her children has stuff happened to her children when they were in cora's care why do you want um full custody just just goes to show that sometimes when separation and divorce happens it's just like people uh, become their meanest version you know and for cora she said something like she has been you know trying to do this whole um co-parenting stuff the best way or the most peaceful way possible and from what justin is showing right now is like he wants to go all out he wants to you know get at her because if you go for a woman's children you are trying to get at her you know, if Cora was the one trying to take this children away from Justin, who would come and say, um, Cora, don't do this. Like how we're talking for Mr. Bassi right now. Allow the both parents to see their children if no one is posing harm to the children. It's just the same humane thing to do. The both of you have the children. Your marriage, your divorce, your separation should never make these children miss out on the other person's training. You understand? On the other person's love. Because you can have this child when you have, or these children rather, when you have them. Cora can have them when she has them. Everybody can do this thing as hard as it is, peacefully, get on with your life. But now one person wants to take over. And now Justin asking for spousal support. I think that Justin has seen how Cora has been moving on post their separation. You know, she's been thriving, she's been traveling. So I thought Justin talked about how much he earns as a doctor. You know, he actually talked um, talked about the fact that he earns a lot of money so as a doctor is he trying to say right now that Cora is earning way 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 more than he is because before he wasn't making it look like that so why do you want spousal support you know you might want to say that she you helped her build her career or something maybe he wants to say he invested in her but she's also saying in the, this video that she also built him so I don't know who is going to measure the amount of cement that was used in the building. You know, who built who the most so that they don't know who will pay spousal support. But like I said, I think that sometimes separation and divorce just brings out the meanest part of some people. Because if you are doing well and Cora is doing well, like why do you want spousal support? And I'm not saying this because Cora is a woman or anything. You get, uh, Justin has claimed that he's successful. So if your wife is doing things for her children, like you said, paying fees and you're not contributing in that aspect, 
at least you have two children that she's raising consider that those two, two children are um the spousal support that she's paying also cora talked about um what she was going to do sue for defamation and i have to come in here to say that cora i think that maybe her lawyer has to advise her here that when it comes to all these things the, the plans that you have for somebody i don't think she should tell him what she wants to do to him because this is like giving telling somebody i'm going to deal with you and you are telling the person you will deal with them because you're already giving them an, an idea what you will do to them so it's like nothing is secret again justin is not surprised with anything the same way that cora got surprised by justin asking for you know spousal support and asking for full custody i think that's how you should be coming at him right now since everybody not the only one person that going to be the other person since you want to uh, you don't want to choose peace you know if you want to come at him let him not see you coming so i think that some things even though you want to share with us online in law some things he should know after you have done your own i mean i hope that they find peace so but you know sometimes one person cannot be the only one finding peace sometimes you have to return energy so that everybody will know say two can play that game because that's what it is right now i'm not gonna say anything about it but I, god knows that i helped him to grow to the best of my ability my entire life was dedicated to him and now he felt something to rip me, separate me from my daughters. How is that helping my daughters? If you care about the children, why are you hurting the mother? She said earlier on that she's thankful for the judge and how, you know, things turned out following the, um, what Justin was trying to do. So let's see how it goes from here on. Because, um, like I said, if you care about these children, why do you want to separate them from their mother? Especially when their mother has not posed any threat to their life, when she has not been a terrible mom or anything. If you really care about them, I don't get it. But let me know your thoughts are in the comment section. Do you think that if Justin invested in Cora or anything, he has any right to ask for spousal support, considering in quote that he said he was doing great himself when this whole money issue was flying up, you know, because initially Cora um talked about he wanting money from her and he actually came out to put how much he was earning as a doctor. So do you think he's, he's doing the right thing by asking for spousal support? Do you also think that he's doing the right thing by wanting full custody um, of his children? Do you even think he can handle them if he has full custody? Let me know your thoughts are in the comment section. It's the Rooster and I thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, you know what to do. Like it, like it, like it. Turn on the bell, subscribe. Please follow us on our Facebook page. I will see you in my next video. Bye.